Sam and I are loaded up. We're gonna go pick up a golf cart. If you had a eagle eye in the last video where we got the galaxy, get it, son. Jeez. I think Sam spotted the golf cart and he wanted it, and the dude ended up offering it, like to give it to us for free. So we're gonna go get that today. Goodbye. But before we do that, we gotta go pick up Lily from school. So we're gonna go ahead and risk it and we're gonna take the Pinto. So this will be the Pinto's first uh, cruise into town with the kids. Lily's been excited about this. She's wanted to be picked up in this thing for a while. So as soon as Sam's done scarfing down this mac and cheese, <laughs> we'll go get her. We successfully made it to Lily's school and uh, waiting for her to come out. She's gonna be really excited. You getting a look so far? Once. Once, one look. One person admired dude, the Pinto. A dude drove by and smiled. Yeah. Is she coming? There she is, there she is. <laughs> hey, baby. What's this thing? <laughs> it's a pinto. Ooh. Hey, baby. You excited? <laughs> I didn't know it was even worse. This is really cool. It looks kind of like a submarine almost. <laughs> Thank like you. It does, there. right? With the portholes? What do you think, Lily? You excited to be picked up in the pinto? Yeah, it's fun, right? We're going to go ahead and cruise around town for the kids. My dream. My dream. Oh, yeah. Sam's got a... If he wants a Mustang, he can be like the ambulance. from Lily. Cool. Are you comfy? It was cool, just cool. Hey, there's Rowan. Hey, <laughs> we made it. Oh, what's he got on? Sherman! Wait, did you roll your window down or up? It's down, it's all right. We can roll them up while we go. All right, we're all loaded up, ready to go get the golf cart. Here's the golf cart. There it is. What you think, Lily? We can make this thing look good, right? It's lifted up. Watch out, there could be wasp or something. Looks good, huh? Here's the bed. There's the seat back. It's kind of nasty. That's the seat bottom, which is obviously rotten. We're going to have to fix that. Here's the roof. Why does this look like a bed? That is the bed. There's a bed? Yeah, it's gonna have a bed. A bed will come out to here, the oh, little tilt cool. thing. It's all right. This was a green club car yeah. or whatever. And it's actually, this is paint. Weird. So we paint with, uh, it's all paint. Oh, well, it's kind of cool.
All right, we're loaded up, ready to go. The guy was super generous to give us this golf cart. Tires actually hold air. He gave me the entire kit to put a small engine in this thing. This is uh, it's pretty exciting. And we didn't even realize it kind of matches the Pinto with that orange stripe. So uh, I kind of ghetto rigged, uh, got this thing tied down. We'll just have to watch that, but let's, uh, let's get on out of here. It's a train. Look, Look at that. the chickens. Bye bye, oh, chickens. We should show them the bridge, right, son? There's a bridge. You gotta see what? this bridge. It is epic. We should drive on it. What? Jared. Yeah. yeah. Come on. It's gonna be fun going off road in this thing. All right, look up here to your left. Uh. Let's drive on that it. wooden clunk dunk. How epic Come on. is that bridge, y'all? What the heck is that for, though? It used to be double wide. It's actually in good shape. It's just the ties. Somebody built that. Yeah, to their ranch. Isn't that cool? Wow. That's crazy. Those are railroad ties. Oh, I bet it was the, the train guy. Probably. Yeah, we all gotta wash our hands. Go right there, use more grip. Look at that bluff. I can just picture Indians here, you know? Indians sitting on these culverts in the 1800s. Yeah, it, like on this uh, concrete. On this concrete, Indians just chilling here, yeah. <laughs> All right, get in. Sam was about to go swimming. Wow, look at that. I love the grass right by the water. There's raccoon poop on that rock. So just just on that right one here. rock. Just that one rock. Had yeah, poop. You, and you could see it from where you're at. Look yeah. At, look at the, oh my God. What? The you're moon, the out. view. Oh yeah, that's cool. You need a picture of that. Whoa. Epic. Damn bird. Beautiful. So, all right, guys. So, what do you think about the golf cart? Thumbs up from the wife. Amazing. Yeah. Oh. It's gonna be fun. Billy, what do you think? You think we'll be able to make that fun? Yeah. Got a thumbs up from her. Awesome. Me Look. and Lily will will be in the golf cart, and you and Sam will be in the Pinto. It's fine. And we can have races. Oh wait, well, you probably beat us actually. <laughs> yeah. Let's get this thing home. How is it, bud? All right, so we made it home. You like it? Come on, come here. Do an inspection of this. What do you think, bud? You can't get on. <laughs> I know, right? It's too tall for Sherman. We're gonna go ahead and pressure wash this thing so we can park it in the, the garage. We got a bunch of stuff there to clean up. The back seat's in bad condition, or the front seat actually. And apparently I left my gloves on the trailer and I only got one now. Dang it. And a um, brand new exhaust pipe. I thought he said muffler, but I don't see a muffler anywhere. And all the bracketry from Vegas golf carts or something like that. All right, Sam, let's start pressure washing. <laughs> We got it in the shop. We got it all cleaned up. It's looking really good. 
Um, we're really excited about this one. You know, the wife and I, the wife has been wanting a golf cart for a long time. Like I, I for years I would get abandoned or free uh, lawn mowers and just junk and bringing it home and uh, and dragging it home and, and flipping it to sell it and whatnot and a few things I would keep. And for years she's been saying like, man, if you ever see a golf cart, get a golf cart. She didn't like seeing all the, the junk that I bring home, but she does want a golf cart. And finally, years later, we finally got an opportunity to bring home a golf cart, and uh, this is it. He gave us this brand new kit, never installed, to put a, well, it says for a V-twin, a 690, I think, CC V-twin, and that's a 420. Um, oh, well. He gave us a 420 Predator and uh, the kit for a 690. I'm hoping it works, or 670, to install in this hole right there and make the same work. Now, this golf cart he gave us includes the bed, which is in good shape, the seat back, which is in okay shape, and the seat bottom, which is in absolute terrible shape. So we're gonna need a new seat bottom. Um, sorry about the crazy camera work here. I uh, got a top that's actually in, it's in pretty good shape. The holes are a little bit busted out, but you know, we can make the same work. Anyways, um, it's drying off now. We, uh, he aired up the tires when we got there and you can hear them leaking down right now. I think just throwing some green slime in there will make them last for the meantime because I don't really want to buy tires for this. But if I do, it's not too bad. Anyways, um, just really excited about this new project. I think it's going to be awesome. I think we're going to have a good time. We really have nowhere to even drive this thing. But the thought is like we can take this thing to Concan, Texas, where we have a rental cabin and we can go there anytime we want and uh, cruise this thing to the river and back. This would be super fun for that. But also we could take to my parents' house. They have a, a neighborhood which like cops never go there and you can, everybody cruises golf carts around and go check their mail and whatnot. I would like to get the rear seat set up that way all four of us can ride on it without cramming in just one seat. Or I could put those um, boat seats. Maybe I could like mount those boat seats in this bed right here and the kids could ride there in the bed. That might be fun. And still retain the usability of a bed. If you got any tips or tricks on golf carts let me know because i've never dealt with a golf cart in my life new territory it's gonna be fun we're looking forward to this one one thing i noticed i tried to get the glove box open and uh, it's all locked but look at this you could just pull this off of here and access everything this is just a carbon fiber cover which kind of dresses it up that's funny somebody really did a good job of painting this thing I thought it was vinyl at first, but look at this speckle stuff. It's pretty neat, and they even clear-coated they clear -coated the whole thing. It was actually a pretty good quality job at one point. And uh, the guy that I bought it from, or maybe whoever had it before him, had already started installing this big bore kit. So that is the, the motor cradle down there, and um, a couple brackets have already been installed. Now here's the 420 Predator engine that the guy gave me, and uh, the word is that that spark plug hole is stripped out. So I'm gonna try to just trace the threads and see if I can get a spark plug to stick in there. Hopefully that is the solution and I don't have to put a helical in this thing. One other thing I noticed is the fuel tank is cracked. Now this should be covered by the seat and maybe I could put some JB Weld over that. Not sure if that's supposed to be a vent or what, but uh, hopefully we could save this. These tires are GBC Dirt Devil All-Terrains. They're 24 by 11 on 12s. And pretty cool looking polished aluminum wheels. At least they're not polished now, but they were probably once polished. And I think once we polish those up, it would probably look really, really good. I'm not into chrome, but polished aluminum, that's gonna look good. Since those videos that you just saw, I have ordered a clutch for this thing. I found out that the instruction booklet that he gave me was not the right big bore kit instructions. Um, I had to contact VegasCarts.com and they sent me the correct big bore kit uh, for the, they called it the old kit for the Predator 420 right there to install in here. As you can see, we got a lot of work cut out for us. We got a lot of things we got to do this, but I think uh, the clutch should be in tomorrow and we got a long weekend ahead of us. So we're going to get busy working on this thing. Hopefully be able to produce a video for y'all and produce a, a golf cart for us to have fun on um, In the very near future. So also keep an eye out You will be able to see a video on the Pinto in one week It's gonna be a shorter video than normal just as this one is I'm trying to shorten my video length because um, I've been told by a lot of people that my videos are too long 
and uh, I'm not able to produce videos quite as often if I do hour-long videos. So 15, 20 minute long videos, but produce them at least every two weeks, maybe even every week. Anyways, uh, thanks for watching this video, episode, whatever you want to call it. If you enjoyed it, please give it a like. It helps the channel a lot. If you got any questions, comment down below. And if you don't mind subscribing, that would be awesome. It really helps me out. If you want to see more of this stuff, stay tuned. Anyways, uh, check out my Instagram, Texas Hillbilly J. Check out our store if you feel like supporting the channel. Get a hat or a shirt. Don't expect high quality because it's by spring.com. So sorry, but it does help me out a little bit. So anyways, thanks for watching and we will see you in one week.